Hello and welcome to First Coast Living. I'm Jordan Wilkerson. And I'm Mike Pringley. Are you ready for summer? I mean, I can't believe it's pretty much here, right? For a lot of us, that means beach trips. Uh -huh. I like that. Lazy days by the pool, mm -hmm. vacations. But you also need some stuff to keep the kids busy, right? Especially oh, when they're out sure. of school. So uh, my favorite thing about summer break back in the day was always actually going to see family. And coming here was mm -hmm. one of them, you know, growing up in Clearwater. Right. I would come up here to see my grandma who still see? lives here on the west side. We love grandma. you, Sarah. <laughs> and so, and other family, you know, I have some extended family here as well. What about you? Oh, I love traveling the country, seeing my cousins. See, I family. Ocean City, yes. We meet my cousins from Ohio. And uh, it was just great. And of course, I spent a lot of time with my grandparents. I was very lucky. Yeah, same. That was really so, nice so you were able to, to learn some more stuff that the kids can do right yeah so summer camps I, I was a summer camp kid so i caught up with the folks over at fun for first coast kids to help you pinpoint the right direction for your summer enrichment and fun there's over a thousand camps oh, really? on the first coast alone but they make it easy for you to pick it out have no fear fun for first coast kids is here let's welcome caitlin tadone and jamie sarnowski mm -hmm. they're both with fun for kids first coast kids and here to help us make the best choices so our kids can enjoy all that summer has to offer great to see you yes you too, you too. Thanks, thanks for having us yes we're talking before the show about our kids and you know jacksonville's a little different where these summer camps there's so many out there but they fill up so fast mm -hmm. so where can parents go for the best information to pick those camps out as soon as possible. We'll start with Caitlin here. Yeah, so um, on our website, we have what we call our camp landing page where all of the um, summer camps in Jacksonville or in and around Jacksonville on the first coast, mm -hmm. um, we've organized them into pages for everyone. So for instance, if you're looking for a dance camp or your son or daughter is interested in STEM camps or swimming camps, you can go and see all of the pages that we have um, and you can choose what makes the most sense for your family. Very good. And for parents, yeah. for instance, that are working and yes. you have some help for them as well. Yeah, yeah. So we get that question a lot. Like Jamie and myself, we're mm. working full time um, right. this summer. And so we need full time care for our, our children. And so we have a page dedicated to that um, where everything, all camps on that page will be camps that are offered for the entire summer, eight or nine weeks of the summer, mm -hmm. um, which is really helpful for, for parents that need full-time care. And then some of these camps, okay, so some parents need a full week's worth of camps or several mm -hmm. weeks, and what about the parents that just don't need a full week of camps? What can they go to? Yeah, so um, for, you know, careers like teaching and, and lots of other uh, positions where they're staying at home, and so they, they want to be with the children and have time um, with summer since they're not in school and all of their activities. Um, but they also, they want to spend time with them, but they also know they may want a little bit of a camp experience. And so there, we have a page dedicated to camps that you can um, pay by the day instead of by the week. So if you wow. want specific days or you want maybe a drop-in camp, we have a page um, just for that, pay by the day camps. So organized. Yeah. Did, did you all put this together? How long did that take? Yeah, it so looks like it would take weeks just to put all does, that together. It, does, it yeah. does take a long time. There's five moms that work on our site oh. um, to organize all of the information. There's huh. over a thousand camps on the first coast. You said and so, over a thousand mm -hmm. camps. <laughs> so uh, we all work together to organize all of the information um, for the parents on mm -hmm. the first coast so that it's a, a much easier way to, to view all of the different camps and make the best choice for their family. All the camps and the ages are broken down as well, even yes. for preschoolers. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So and we know it's how hard it is to find camps for kids that are not yet in kindergarten. So we do have a whole section within our directory that's dedicated just to preschool camps. Mm -hmm. um, there are several, you know, a lot of um, churches and a lot of private schools offer those types of things, but there are other businesses as well. So there's something for everyone and it's a good, easy way to find camps for the younger kiddos as well. Okay, so for parents looking for to Fulfill, fulfill any specific needs of their kids or their families. Yeah. It's right there, right? Yeah. Jamie? Yeah. She was saying there's like a, you know there's a thousand listings. So if you're feeling overwhelmed, we do have an easy way to kind of narrow it down. You can check a box by like um, the week that you're looking for, mm -hmm. the age of your kiddo, the area of town, and there's even a box where if you're looking for free or cheap camps, there's like some affordable options as well. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, it just helps you kind of find that. I know you guys recently had an interview with Jackie Wallace from the Broadway um, FSCJ Broadway. Yeah. Uh, 
series. So they um, recently announced a scholarship opportunity that they're offering. So um, if you have kids that are between 10 and 17 and they're interested in that, they can apply for $300 off of that camp this summer. So they're really trying to encourage, you know, affordable uh, ways for people to experience the arts. So it's an awesome opportunity. Very exciting. I'm, yeah. I feel like it's summer now. I'm ready for <laughs> summer. We're all geared up. I know, I know. All yeah, right. it's great. Have no fear. Summer for First Coast Kids is here. You all do such a wonderful job Thank for you. community and all the kids and families out Thanks. there. Thanks. And then Thank one you. more thing we wanted to mention too, the um, Jumbo Shrimp, um, we're doing a family movie night uh, May 20th. Okay. So we're going to invite some summer camp advertisers out as well and so we're going to have businesses out there that are going to be able to talk in person with the community and um, you know you can kind of get it more hands-on experience of what they have to offer and it's also a fun movie night they're going to show bad guys on the field it's only a dollar yeah, and they fun. open I've it to the community I, yeah. yeah yeah so it's going to be great it's a fun time <laughs> very good well jamie and caitlin thank you once again yeah, and of course you. for much more on the summer camp, camp fun and all the events going on yeah just head to our website and that's firstcoastliving.net